Hi, welcome um, to a wig journey with Julia. I'm Julia. Um, I just wanted to give you an update on a wig that I received today from Amazon. It came in a notorious yellow manila envelope. And inside that was a bag. And it's from Wig Buy. Never purchased a wig from them before. I had saw a wig that I liked um, on their site on Amazon and it was always out of the strawberry blonde so I waited and I just happened to catch it last week that they got it in and they said in stock so I ordered it um, I want to say it was like $23 total so inside the wig by bag is the wig it is strawberry blonde it's very close to my Lydell color um, it's very close to my hair cube color. It's a little bit lighter. Well, the hair cube is darker. Immediately upon opening it, there's tissue paper inside. It's a standard cap, no frills, bra straps for adjusters. Um, density is is low, um, which all the things I like. I don't mind any of that. Um, now, the review said that People, it was a hit or miss. Uh, a lot of the reviews said that it was a great wig, but it needed to be manipulated. Other people said that they couldn't get past the bird's nest on top. Now, she definitely has box head um, or shelf head or whatever where she was. There is an indentation. Um, just looking at her, it's not, it's not going away. Um, it's right there. So I think I'm going to have, if I keep her, I'm going to have to do some manipulation to keep her. Um, the color is beautiful. I love the color. Um, does seem to be a little bit staticky. Uh, but she seems nice. Other than that bird's nest up there. Um, and I don't see how I'm going to be able to disguise that because there's no overlapping hair. That is the crown. Um, so... Upon looking at her, I think that this will be going back. Um, and since I bought it through Amazon, it said this item is returnable. So um, the number is wig by long layer sh dot 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 ti color for women 27b. Now, the number also there's a number on the bag, and that was x. 0028E as an Edward 6XZ3. Um, again, I think I want to say it was like $23 and it was from Amazon. Um, so if you put in a strawberry um, long layer wig, I'm sure this will pop up. Uh, I don't even know if I want to try it on. Um, I'm not happy with this. Like I said, the review said it was a hit or miss. Some people said that theirs were fine. Other people said that the crown was really a mess. And I think this one is a mess. So, um, let me put you on a brief hold and I will try her on, but I don't think I'm keeping her. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm back. She's on. Um, first, let me say she is very big head friendly. Um and she is shedding. I just put her on and my lap has just, just shedding. So this by far is probably one of the cheapest $23 wigs I've purchased. I guess I have been lucky. Um, my Lydell wigs were, were, you know, inexpensive. My hair cube was inexpensive and I'm still going strong with um, my Lydell, well, my Lydell and well, my second one. And they, because I think I was just so rough with the first one. And now I know washing them less is, is better than, you know, every couple wears. I, I, I try and go a little bit longer now. And, but this one is just, the color is beautiful. I like the color. It's a little bit shiny, but uh, you know, um, you know, the sh dry shampoo will take that down a notch. I just don't think I can do anything about the crown. Um, let me put you in another hold. I'm going to go check in the bigger mirror. Okay, yes. I went into my bedroom mirror and looked in there. Um, and I have brought some of the hair over. 
Uh, I don't see any wefts. It's a very low density, but it's a very big head friendly. Um, probably too big for my head, and I have a 22 and a half inch head. I probably would have to make it tighter. Like I said, to keep this $23 wig, I'd have to manipulate it, and I don't know if I really think it's worth it. Um, you know, I don't know. It's a lot to do. Oh, let me turn around. You can see the 360, how long this thing is, too. right side I mean <laughs> she's I'm five foot three and a quarter and she's down you know to my boobs so um, and like I said there's a lot of flyaways I'm having a hard time controlling it uh, to keep it out of my face I didn't even comb it yet I'm afraid if I comb it, it's only gonna create more of a static electricity the color, like I said, the color, um, I really like the color, but yeah, I don't think, even with, and then I have to worry about this lump too, this, where it's sticking up. So I don't think I have damaged the integrity of the crown too much to send it back. Um, and I think it, it says on the form, on the form, when you return it, I had to return a, um, the Vega Fox because of the weft showing. Uh, I'm just saying how it's not made right. It's, there's a, I mean, I don't even know if I could get that out. I guess, I guess they wear out. I don't know. I don't know what, it, I don't know what it looks like in the, in the uh, camera, but okay. Well, so anyway, I'm not very happy with it. I most likely is going back. If I do decide to keep it, I will post another video and show you what I have done to it. Um, again, this is by wig by long strawberry blonde wig under $23 um, and uh, it was a hit or miss and I knew that reading the reviews uh, you know sometimes you just you just listen to the reviews but yeah she is just shedding up she's shedding just like my bio hair sheds <laughs> anyway all right thanks for tuning in and um, have a great night and god bless bye